Hi friends, I have here cherry uh, tomato plants uh, variety here. If you see this, uh, they have almost grown to one feet height. So we have got time to transplant them into individual containers. And uh, here I have uh, prepared my potting mix also ready. If you notice there, uh, I am using a lot of uh, cocoa peat uh, in order to reduce the weight on my terrace uh, portion. And this is poultry manure basically. And uh, this is on cocoa peat. And I have also already used here uh, neem cake powder also I have added. And garden soil is very less if I have to say. And uh, I will be adding sand also to this. Uh, in case you don't have sand, you may replace it with uh, rice husk or uh, you know uh, vermiculite or perlite. So currently I have sand, so I'll be using sand also here. So I'll be preparing the organic mix, and then I'll be uh, you know putting them into uh, containers, and then I will again show you. So here I have uh, two varieties of grow bags. One, this is 12 inch size, uh, 12 inch height grow bag. Uh, dia is also 12 inch and the height of the grow bag is also 12 inch and here yeah, I have uh, 18 inch uh, width and uh, sorry 18 inch length and uh, 12 inch width and this height is around roughly 8 inches or uh, 9 inches nine height inches. Uh, grow bags I have two varieties in order to place my cherry tomato saplings here so uh, let me fill this uh, soil my potting soil into this grow bags and let me arrange all of them and I'll show you in between uh, how I'm going to uh, transplant those uh, cherry tomatoes as well. So let's get started. So when is it ideal time to transplant the plants? So if you see, I am transplanting the plants in the evening, uh, late in the evening, that's after five o'clock, six o'clock, five o'clock. Uh, so why, why is that? Because um, when you transplant the plants in the evening, the plants will have the entire night to get used to the new environment before the sun comes up. And moreover, the roots are very sensitive that I don't want to expose them to the direct sunlight. So that when are the tomatoes ready for transplanting? So the basically the tomato plants are ready for transplanting into larger containers when the saplings are around 5 to 7 inches tall. So basically at this height the root system would have developed good and the plants will have better chances of survival in the uh, outside uh, environment. So waiting too long also will lead to yellowing of the roots, yellowing of the leaves and the roots uh, will also start growing out of the holes, drain holes. So the tomato plants which you are seeing here are around uh, 7 to uh, 8 weeks old. So basically the short fleshy uh, thorn like needles which you will be seeing on the tomato stem are uh, called adventitious roots or aerial roots. So basically these roots uh, when placed in contact with the soil will uh, form into uh, normal roots. So planting the tomato saplings deep into the soil will increase the depth of the root system and this will in turn keep the plant sturdy as it keeps growing. So in case you don't have more stem to bury, uh, like how I have shown you here, then uh, if you have a lot of foliage on the plant, all you I would suggest is uh, chop off all the bottom set of leaves and then retain only the top set of the leaves. And then uh, plant these deep, uh, uh, plant these uh, saplings as deep as you can uh, in the uh, pot. And then uh, fill it with the soil. So here I am just trying to uh, place them as deep as I can into the soil and I am uh, uh, replacing it with the soil and I am then uh, firm, uh, pressing it gently and firmly because I want to remove all the air pockets in the soil. Uh, so then moving on to sunlight requirements of this plant, tomato plants require at least uh, 8 hours of uh, direct sunlight in a day. And then uh, moving on to watering conditions, after uh, this uh, entire transplantation complete, uh, provide it with sufficient amount of water uh, because the moisture will help the plant adjust to the new environment and then for the next few days keep monitoring the health of the plant check for any signs like uh, wilting or drooping so that's it folks for this video uh, subsequently i'll share uh, videos related to staking and plant care of these tomato plants and if you like this video check out for other videos in my channel as well and consider subscribing to my channel happy gardening